We're learning more about a homicide investigation that brought Sacramento police to Oakland looking for a man accused of killing his girlfriend. That search ended late last night with a shooting by Oakland police, and now a man is dead. KTVU's Ali Rasmus has new information on what happened. Gunshots fired outside a home near 16th and Chestnut Streets in Oakland, 9.30 last night. It came after Sacramento police arrived in the neighborhood looking for a man suspected of shooting and killing his girlfriend last month. On March 3rd, Sacramento police were called to do a welfare check at a home on Ventura Street. Sacramento police described what happened when they arrived. While they were conducting that welfare check, officers heard sounds of shots fired. Uh, they retreated out of that area. They set up a perimeter. And shortly afterwards, they found 34-year-old Rama Al-Saraj dead from a gunshot wound. Sacramento police believe her boyfriend, 32-year-old Dominique Broad, was the killer who fled the scene. Fast forward a month and a half later, and Sacramento police say they tracked down Broad to this Oakland home. They called Oakland police last night for help to arrest him. In a recorded statement shared on social media, an Oakland police spokesperson described what then happened next. Oakland police officers arrived on scene, and as they began securing the area and requesting additional resources, the suspect emerged from the residence with the firearm. At that point, Oakland police say their officers fired at the suspect outside the home, shooting and killing him. No officers were hurt. We're still waiting for official confirmation from Oakland police that the man they shot and killed was, in fact, the domestic violence suspect that Sacramento police were looking for. In Oakland, Ali Rasmus, KTVU, Fox 2 News.